In artillery, chain shot is an obsolete type of naval ammunition formed of two sub-caliber balls, or half-balls, chained together. Bar shot is similar, but joined by a solid bar. They were used in naval warfare in the age of sailing ships and black powder cannons to shoot masts, or to cut the shrouds and any other rigging of a target ship. When fired, after leaving the muzzle, the shot's components stumble in the air, and the connecting chain fully extends. In past use, as much as six feet of chain would sweep through the target. However, the tumbling made both bar and chain shot less accurate, so they were used at shorter ranges. While it could inflict grievous injury, chain shot was normally not used as an anti-personnel load. This role was fulfilled more effectively and at lower cost by canister shot or grape shot. Chain shot was used by the defenders of Magdeburg in May 1631 as an anti-personnel load, which, according to Count Councillor Otto von Gerich, was one reason for the extreme violence of the victorious attackers. The military usefulness of chain shot died out as wooden sail powered ships were replaced with armoured steam ships, first among navies, and then among commercial fleets, which do not have rigging to serve as proper targets for chain shot. Additionally, the conversion of naval armament from smoothbore, muzzle loaded black powder cannons to rifled, breech-loaded guns further slowed the production of new chain-shot ammunition, the chain would damage barrels, and the new breech-loading guns and their ammunition were meant to be effective against armoured vessels as well as wooden sailing vessels. In modern times, the effect is replicated in shotguns with the use of bolo shells, a pair of slugs connected by a strong wire. They are banned in several jurisdictions, including Florida and Illinois.